Local organizations and survivors are teaming up to end drug overdoses here in Kentucky, and the group is called Vocal Kentucky. The Commonwealth Drug Overdose Report shows 2,250 Kentuckians died from drug overdoses in 2021. That is about a 15% increase from 2020. According to that report, that rise was driven by the use of fentanyl. The drug was involved in approximately 70% of the deaths, and now a new plan to stop them. WHAS 11's Alexis Jones is live in the newsroom with the story, Alexis. Members of Vocal Kentucky say drug overdosing has been an issue for far too long. They are calling on city leaders and community members to help save lives. I got people that wanted to get high with me. I had people that wanted to do this with me, but nobody never cared to show me that I deserve better. Today marks one year since Pony found a place to call home. In our books, we read that the only thing that come from under the bridges was trolls, but it's not true. We're people too. Pony survived homelessness and IV drug addiction. He says he also lost many loved ones to overdoses over the years. I can't even tell you how many. Pony is now a member of the new organization, Vocal Kentucky. Members gathered at Jefferson Square Park to share their roadmap to end overdoses. End overdose now! That includes more funding for housing, better access to services and treatment, and stopping the criminalization of drug use. Why did the numbers go up? Why did the overdose numbers go up when we have access? Why are children overdosing? That's right. According to the Kentucky Office of Drug Control Policy, 2,250 people died from drug overdoses last year. An inmate at Louisville Metro Correction also died from an overdose in July. Members of Vocal Kentucky say they can't watch another person die from drug abuse. How many more people have to die before we do something? Members say they're going to meet up with Mayor Fisher tomorrow to come up with a plan to end overdoses. 